Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Spirit of Sonata, Samurai Warriors, whatever this game's called. I'm a serious JG. In off screen action, I returned, uh, this time using Kunoichi so I could visit all the screens, to the new Sanada playground, whatever the hell, Mount, whatever. We encountered the bear again. This time it said the bear seems to be in a bad mood. I also fought the fire bomb soldier, whatever. No special dialogue, but after I defeated one, it is the special recurring enemy of the area, I got the um, Sanada public safety uh, quest complete. And I, I got every type of item that drops there. I can tell because that goal is accomplished. But it did not appear to include the items we need for the needy woman's smile. So... I don't know that we can do that quest right now. Hmm. I am certainly glad you'll be helping us, Mazazuki. Shinao now's local lords can hardly be said to be of one mind. Kunishu, local lords. The effective ruler of a province or small territory. They were also referred to as provincial or local lords. Unlike rulers appointed by the shogunate or the imperial court, they had their own military stationed on their land. They were often labeled as villains who opposed the ruling faction during the Kamakura period. A general weakness of the government during the Sengoku period caused them to grow even more independent. Although they often became the vassals of the Sengoku daimyo, some even rose to the lofty status of daimyo themselves. In addition to the Sanada, the Chosokabe and the Mori were also kunishi at one time. With the Tagata wobbling under the weight of history, we local lords need a leader. We believe the Sanada are the only ones worthy of our dedication. The Takata will remain firm. I misspoke. You must forgive us. Gifts can now be presented to Masatsuke Iwara. Okay, well, maybe he's a guy who can give us special items we need for the whatever. Let's try giving him some metal. Oh no, let's talk to him and see if it gives us a clue. Because I didn't realize we'd never spoken to this guy. Yuki Takasan his third son, the father of Lady Muramatsu, Nobuyuki, and Yuki Mura. Oh, that's me. Duh. A Kunishu, or local lord of Shinaonao. He was also known as Morikiyo. He served the Takata clan and was considered the leader of the Koshu Supa. Koshu referred to the area of Kai, present day Yaman, Yamanashi Prefecture, while Supa was a word meaning ninja. He considered Masayuki to be a man who could unite the Kunishu of Shinaonao. It's not really pronounced Shinaonao, I'm sure. And it was one of the first retainers to serve him. Ninjas required various tools in order to carry out their duties. This undoubtedly included high quality thread. Okay, so he's into thread. So, which of these represent threads? None of these appear to be threads. White snake skin? Thank you very much. That did nothing. That also did nothing. Well, that was better than the rest of this crap has been. So it's not metal, it's not crystal. Maybe string is considered a plant? Nope. I don't have that many plants anymore because I'm not bothering with the farming minigame. likes bugs. Oh, I, I guess that would make sense for thread. Silkworms or whatever. Okay, so let's, uh, I guess giving him the wrong kind of gifts enough times in the game takes pity on you. Uh, worm, plump worm, bee, centipede, silkworm is probably it then. Hmm, a gift to a ninja. A silkworm, a moth from which a most excellent thread can be harvested. 
is an unusual animal that its level form is more prized than its adult form. Okay, so I got plenty of silkworms. Let's give them uh, like 10 so we can get whatever. I'll give him 12 because that's what I accidentally scrolled to. Oh, he's in love with me. Here's a little something as a thank you. Foxglove times 12. High quality wood used to make musical instrument and large furniture prevalent in the Iga Mountains. Maybe that's what I was missing for this? No, I still need Lotus and Cru Crucian Harp, which I have none of. So that didn't actually help. I'm sure I'll need it for something else, but um... Yo 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 let me speak on this orally. Can you bring Shingen back alive so I can talk to him? Apparently not. Kunoichi will not be available for a lot of chatter. She doesn't seem to be She represents like she's not really an individual character. She represents the concept of the Sonata having ninjas. Still not bothering to collect on that. Mazayuki sama. We're gonna see how this battle will help the talk. in any way, our task is not to question why ours is but to do or die. Is there any chance that we could use this as an opportunity to crush you, Asuki, under the boot of the Takeda? No. I see. So this guy is not suddenly offering to go out and hunt for crabs or whatever for me. Do I already have I already given him gifts? Yes. Yeah, I've already maxed out friendship with him. It's just whatever he gave me, I don't seem to care about. You, Azuki, are waging a war between two brothers. I cannot believe it. Your sister always seems to be scolding you. That well, that's different. Chili does that because we're so close. Ha <laughs> ha. A b -b -b bear Lord Mazuki, terrible news. What is it? What's the noise about? It's a bear. Oh, well, I've been encountering the bear, but I don't know what the hell the point of that is. I love planting seeds, which is more exciting waiting for them to bud. Yeah, kid, that sure is. I guess I'll do this one at least. Uh, citron, Capisum, Wasabi, Citron. I only get an A. I keep forgetting that the, the instant you collect it, it doesn't have like a... You don't really know or get much lead in that you're doing the mini game. so... Constant warring has destroyed the soil, so I'll just keep destroying it even more. Hard horse is great. Hey, Dias, Stinka. Okay, there's nothing to do with this guy right now. It's a wonderful day for a moon dance. If you having any luck, please remember to leave some for me. See, it looks like they have new dialogue, but they don't. Oh well. So the public safety thing I need to report to whoever that was who gave us that one. Fortune smile upon you. Thank you for your wishes. I am relying on you to look after Lord Katsuyori. Yeah, whatever. The warehouse man, I guess, said the public safety one. Wonderful. The remaining thieves have all scattered on the winds. At last, peace returned to the Senate. Thank you so much. These are some vegetables my wife raised. They taste really good. I've already eaten them. Persimmon, turnip, potato. And it just kicks me. Okay, well, that was an exciting quest. Lady Muramatsu is gonna give us a stratagem? Will this be another difficult battle, Father? I fear so. Kagakatsu is fighting for the succession against 
Kagatora Uesugi was born in the Hojo clan that adopted Mother Uesugi. Kagatora Uesugi, Ujiyasa Hoju's seventh son and Lady Hayakawa's younger brother. Originally, his name was Saburo Hojo. He was taken in as Kenshin Uesugi's son as proof of the alliance between the Hojo and the Uesugi and given the name Kagatora. His wife was Aya's daughter and the older sister of Kagakatsu. As such, he was Kagakatsu's brother-in-law in two different ways. It got a little weird. At first, he lamented being taken as a hostage from the Hojo, but eventually developed into a fine young man through Kenshin's training and his rivalry with Kagakatsu. Later, he committed himself to supporting the future of the Uesugi, but... Oh, I see. Then fighting against Master Kagatora necessarily entails... That's right. It could get very messy. Thanks for giving me more sanity points. Maybe I'll write about the Kaisagami Alliance and the Chronicles. The Kaisagami Alliance. This was an alliance formed between the Takata clan and the Hojo clan. Kai referred to a chick from the games, but also referred to a land that's currently Yamanashi Prefecture, while Sagami was a land that is currently Kanagawa Prefecture. Originally, the two clans were also in alliance with the Imagawa clan, but relations between them worsened after Shingen and Takata attacked the Imagawa, which caused the Hojo clan, who were close to the Imagawa, to side with Umisuki. However, it was difficult for the Imbagawa to reverse their decline, and seeing their struggles against the Takada, the Hojo once again sided with the Takada and reformed the alliance between Kai and Sagami. Katsuyori took Ujisama's, uh, Ujimasa's younger sister as his wife in order to strengthen the alliance, but it dissolved in the face of the Otate Rebellion, which put the Takada clan in a difficult position. And Miracle Max continues to exist. Masayuki Sama! What do you gotta say, buddy? Another great battle against Yusugi. This is what gets my blood really pumping, don't forget. Those those we are there to help belong to the Yusugi as well. Make sure you know who's on our side, Nike. Oh yes, this battle could get rather tricky, indeed. On top of which our enemies are the only ones I feel more of an affinity with. Are the ones I feel more of an affinity with. What up, boys? Father, are you off to war again? Yes, I am to leave this evening. It seems Iwasugi still have not resolved their differences. I am worried about your health, Father. You must find the time to rest occasionally. <sighs> yes, your only hobby seems to be your work, Father. That's not true, but after this battle, I must make some time to spend with you children. Hi. Yes, why don't we all go fishing, Father, brother, sister, and myself? Not our mother, though. Yukimura, you're terrible at fishing. Why don't we just spend some time together at home? So. If you're not very good at fishing, Yukimura, you'd better get some practice in before we all go together. Otherwise, you will be a failure in life, since the fishing minigame is critical to our success. Would you like to change your player character? I guess? Yes, I will make sure to do so. I think Father was being considerate of my feelings when I'm the one who should be doing that for him. I don't have time to fish right now, but I could at least go to the river. What is the truth at the heart of fishing, brother? Mm, I suppose it is the importance of patience as you wait for a hit on your line. That's that's not an easy thing to master. Yeah, well, whichever. I don't care. The Takada have joined forces with the Uesugi. We already have alliance with the Hojo, yes? That's right. You know your stuff, Lord Yohibura. I mean, young master. I mean, really young master. Which means our only opponents now should be the Oda and the Tokugawa, so are we sending troops to Echigo? Echigo, present day Niigata Prefecture. It was often covered in snow, and its blizzard served to greatly limit Kenshin's movements in the region. The area was known for its rice crops, which were used to make its famous sake. Well, it seems Yuasuki still have other enemies. I don't really understand it myself. I don't know what's going on. Make sure you work on your fishing, you keep it. Yes, Father. Because if you don't, you tan your hide. Lord Ma Masatsune. I'm sorry, my brother could not keep his promise to trade with you, Yuki, but I would like to trade with you myself soon, if that's all right. That would be wonderful, thank you. You have to train me how to be good at fishing, though. Sister, we've decided we're all going fishing together soon. Won't that be great? Oh my, that does sound fun. You say we're all going fishing. Does that include me? No, of course. You must accompany us very well, but you must cook my bait and grab any fish I catch, Yukimura. Wonderful. So you're just gonna be there looking pretty and not doing anything? Yukimura-sama. Yukimura-sama. 
Are you waiting for someone? Talk to Sakon. You can't talk to Kunoichi? Summon Sakon Shima. I come to this regular this TS regularly. Okay, so he doesn't say anything new really. Sis, he has new dialogue, but he just keeps saying the thing about alcohol and occasionally something about people passing by. This is the shop. You want to know anything about making medicine? Hey, will you sell me ingredients you won't sell my dad? No. No, we will not. Hello, Lord. I, you have a secret meeting with Father, yes? Well, not that secret. Why do you say that? Naika told me whenever you were planning some strategy, you have the conniving look on your face. Oh. Hey, hey, did he now, this scoundrel? And then he goes and has him assassinated. Hello, other child. How many worms should I collect today? I don't give a crap. So I guess the plot doesn't progress until we go fishing. Okay. Oh, Kunoichi is chillaxing over here. Maybe this is more important scene than I thought when he talks to Kunoichi. Would you like to change your player character? Well, not yet. I need to go uh, fishing. Okay, I'm gonna catch lots of fish. I want to save in case I screw up doing something story-wise as Kunoichi. But I was thinking, okay, so Kunoichi throughout the Samurai Warrior series, again, she doesn't seem to represent a specific character. She represents, like the concept of the Sonata having ninja, but she's also consistently portrayed as being, like, in love with, to some extent, Yukimura. But particularly in Samurai Warriors 1, um, where he doesn't really seem to acknowledge her at all, but, like, she seems to be completely devoted to him in a romantic, quasi-romantic way. The awesome patience required that they talked about. So I got a loach. I got an extra loach. Hooray, look at all the fish I got. He's awesome. Two fish with one cast is actually pretty good. And he's really excited about it too. Almost too early there, but I got it. Please do something for me. Ain't horses great. Looks like the plot won't advance until I switch to Kunoichi, so. It's weird to see her taller than Yukimura, too. I mean, you. I'll kill you. The young masters of the Sanada. I am a humble ninja dispatched here by Lord Katsuyori. Oh, a master of the covert arts. Master Ned theme song. You are here to help our father in the upcoming battle. Allow me to thank you in advance. Not at all, it is my job, and with Lord Mazayuki at the helm, there's no chance of losing. I'm just along for the ride. Did he just? Is it true that ninjas have to undergo the most intense training for the time of their birth? I guess so. I didn't used to be a ninja, so I really couldn't say. Wait, what? So you weren't trained from birth, then? No, oh, I see. That doesn't make sense at all. Aww. I lost my fathers and brothers in battle and was all alone. Lord Shingen took pity on me and took me in. This is the most backstory Kunoichi's ever had. What is not my place to talk about myself? Please forget what I told you. It was all ninja lies anyway. 
So you follow the way of the ninja in order to repay the debt you owe Lord Shingen. Well, I'm all alone, really, so it's as good a way as any to get by in the world. But now you are part of the Takara clan. You are not alone, and you have us too. Wow, oh my god, I just fell in love with you. Yukimura speaks the truth. We would be honored if you would think of us as your family too. Please, you'll have me in tears soon. Very well then. For the sake of my family, I'll give everything I have. Now, if you don't mind, I have to parade off in my poncho, garters, and hot pants. She's wearing a poncho, garters, and hot pants. Oh, and knee pads. Oh, it's already late. It's time for you to be getting back. Shall I accompany you back to the manor? No, there's still some light. I will be fine, thank you. Then I must be heading off to the battlefield myself. Take care, Lord Yukimura. So I wonder if she has special dialogue with anybody. I don't think I can handle this just because I'm a ninja. Fishing is a piece of cake for me. Yeah, I was kind of wondering if she would be able to fish at all. If it would bother to have a separate dialogue for her in the minigame. So you got killifish. So this is what it means when the fish are biting like crazy. Pretty impressive. Kuroichi, a ninja who serves the Takata clan. Okay, I think we have read this before. Maybe not. Her joking speech and behavior tended to discomfort those around her, but she was a top-class ninja. Maybe we hadn't read that before. In which case, you can... For those of you listening, I guess you'll have to go back and watch the video and pause it if you want to see that. We'll catch ourselves another big all today. Oh, are you interested in fishing? This is a great little spot. You can use the chum balls of the fishing pond hands out, or you can use something better if you have it. Good luck. I hope you catch a big one. I got the big one. Wait, no, that's not right. Thank you very much. You are so stupid. I doubt these characters have anything unique to say to her. A b -b -b bear But some of these characters might. Oh, who's this? I've never seen her around. Uh, oh, excuse me, you there. Oh, I have nothing at all you could want. Please just leave me alone. All I wanted was to ask where, Ma where Lord Mazuyuki was. I suppose I could give you gifts to calm you down. So these guys are ninjas, so they might have ninja stuff to say. Oh, a fellow ninja. Mm, the Takara clan's own ninja. I'm the pride of the son of the ninjas. I will not be outdone. So I've got no interest in all of that kind of petty competition. You guys are way outside of my league. Like, below it, I mean. Oh, a fellow ninja. Yeah, whatever. You must be one of the Takara sent to keep an eye on us. So very cynical. Not that I mind what you call me. I don't give a crap about you guys. She's wearing garters, hot pants... Just kind of athletic boots with knee pads and a poncho. I hadn't really considered that until we saw, like, the view of her while chatting with Yukimura. You used to work for Lord Shingen, as Lord Katsuyori sent you here. That's right. Hmm, I must be very reassuring for Brother Mazuyuki to have you by his side. Please do your best for him. Okay, so they all know she's a ninja, which basically means she sucks at her job. Hmm, suspicious presence. State your business. Oh dear, this could get tricky, but he's an elder of the Sada. I suppose I should greet him properly. I am here to assist Lord Mazayuki under orders from Lord Katsuyori. I am pleased to make your acquaintance. Oh, I see. You're the talk his ninja. Forgive my rudeness. I was looking forward to working with you. Well, that was easy. Just like the children met before, the Sada are turning out to be full of surprises. And crap. Are you waiting for someone? We should be close at this point, but we won't bother with that. This is the shop. You want to know about medicine? Did I already talk to him? Oh, a fellow ninja. Your clothing appears so much noticeable for a ninja. Well, we female ninjas always end up being judged on our appearance as well, you see. Besides, you don't exactly dress like a normal person. Mmm. Oh. Mm. oh. I wonder if this kid will say something about how many worms he wants to catch. 
Yes. Yes, he did. Well, I believe I need to advance uh, Kudoichi's training anyway. It seemed like something that popped up during one of my... Uh... And I found out they're actually... Uh, I, I did a little peeking at a... Well, not a fact exactly, but we will get another chance to play as Aya later. So it might be worth leveling her up. Uh, Kenshin's dead. Like, there are certain characters, like, yeah, Katsuyori is not long for this world, I'm afraid. Uh, and uh, Shingen is dead, Kenshin is dead, Nagamasa is dead, but these other characters will be popping up later, so it might be worth leveling them up. Some of them will be playable later, maybe not all of them. Hisahide, I don't think we'll ever get to play as again. Uh, but Kunoichi, definitely. She's actually going to be one of our main playable characters throughout the whole story. I can spend all the time I want exploring those boring-ass free roam zones. Alright, so I'm going to call it a video just a little early because the only person we have left to talk to is the person who I think is probably going to advance the story. Although I don't know that with certainty. But uh, we will find out next time. Because if we start a video and we don't advance at all, uh, then uh, oops on me. Catch you guys next time. Bye-bye.